uh, Devin and I will always remain friends, but at this point in time, we're kind of on the roads of enemies for the time being. I don't hate him. I don't dislike him. I have nothing but the greatest wishes for him, except for February 17th. There's no no wishing upon a star on that one. Yeah. Uh, well, the victory is mine. Plain and simple. What do you what do you see when you look at that matchup as far as uh, some of his strengths versus your strengths and just how that kind of works? Well, just seeing his strengths versus my strengths, it's a uh, it's a little here and there. I mean, he's left-handed as well. Uh, he's speedy. I can keep up to that speed. I'm powerful. So uh, I'm a little bigger, I think. So you know, it'll, be, it'll be a good time. How does that, when you're facing someone else who's left hand I mean, that doesn't happen, you know, southpaw, that doesn't happen very often. Yeah, how, how does that kind of affect your game plan? Well, it doesn't really affect the game plan if you're trained and do your homework correctly. I mean, uh, I'll tell you... My style versus his, and like they say, styles make fights. I think uh, our fight will be one better than Lomachenko or Brigandale, you know. It's two southpaws, so I don't, I don't think there will be anybody sleeping on my fight. Yeah. What can people expect February 17th at the Haskins Center? Uh, February 17th, Victor Ortiz will hold his hands up in victory. And uh, by knockout or decision, taking it home. Good deal, Victor. That's all I got for you. Thank you very much. I appreciate the time. That's